In this section of the video, I will be explaining the procedure for installing the MOBA XTERM tool. The MOBA XTERM application is recommended by us for performing FTP operations with the Tejas equipment. Also for viewing the diagnosis window when we connect the diagnosis cable to the Tejas equipment. To download MOBA XTERM software, we will search this name in Google. We go to Google search. So we click on search and we see here in the first line itself the download link has been given. We right click and open a new tab. So this is the mobile XTERM page. On this page we can see uh, option download. So under the download folder the files are listed. So this is the home edition. This is a freeware. This can be chosen by us. We scroll down here, click on download now. The right side, we have a green button. We click on this installer edition. We see here in the bottom, the file is being downloaded. So now the file has been successfully downloaded. Now we click here, this option show in folder, we click on this. So we see here that the file has been successfully downloaded. Just to note that the download is successfully completed, we just right click and do a refresh and we see that the file size is not increased. We see here it is in the zip format, we need a unzipping tool. So we can download WinZip or WinRAR. I have with me WinRAR. We right click here and we choose this option extract to mobile extreme installer. In the same window a new folder is created. This folder contains the installation file .msi. This is the Microsoft installer file. We double click this. Now the installation window opens up. We click on next button. We accept the agreement. Next. Then we keep the default settings. Next. And now we need to take forward the installation. Click on the install button. We see here that the Microsoft security settings are a prompt. We click on yes and now the installation is complete. Click on the finish button. Now the installation needs to be verified. We go to the Windows search bar. We click on the search bar and type mobile extra. Here we see the mobile extra application has opened up. If we click on help and about, it shows the software version. So this software version will keep changing. So this is the version number displayed on the day when this video was recorded. We will be using mainly two options. Here we see a button session. We click on this and we see here serial. So this is the option used for the diagnosis window viewing when we connect the diagnosis cable to the Tejas equipment. Then we see the option here servers. So here we see the FTP server. This is used for any FTP transactions between the laptop and the Tejas equipment. So this completes our video where I have explained the procedure for installing the mobile extern tool. I hope you will be able to download on your laptop and utilize this tool for the various activities with the Tejas equipment.